Today I'm going to show you some of the things that I'm really um, excited about, things that I've been using a lot, some of my favourites I suppose. I'm just going to jump into it. Some of the shit's pretty random, but I haven't done one of these in ages so I suppose I better do one now. Um, to be honest, I actually had no idea of what I was going to film that wasn't weight loss related. I took to Twitter and Instagram uh, to ask all you guys what... Um, you want to see on my channel and I got uh, I and this was one of the responses so here we go thank you to um, Taylor for the suggestion because without you I probably would be sitting here twiddling my thumbs or picking my butt or something so <laughs> thanks uh, yeah so here's my current favorite things first of all I'm just going to mention my hat this hat is <laughs> probably one of my absolute favorite accessories at the moment. I have literally been searching for one of these hats for so long and like I mean like months. I really really wanted wanted one so bad and I couldn't find one anywhere and then I was randomly I think I was Christmas shopping and I was randomly in H&M that's where I got this one from. Yeah I saw this and I literally stopped in the shop and was like it was like a I was like so fucking happy to see it. Um, I went to buy it and my card kept declining. It was so fucking embarrassing. You have no idea. But luckily my mother-in-law was there to save the day. So she bought it for me and I pretty much have been wearing it almost every day ever since. It's either wear the hat or have my hair up in a bun, in a mum bun. So... Yeah, I love this hat. I've got a lot of beauty products, which is quite strange because I'm not much of a beauty person. My next thing is this. Um, I don't even know what it's fucking called, hey. It's a uh, new look, sleek and shine, flat iron perfector, straightening mist, 48 hour straight finish um, by Garnier Fructus. And it's um, got argan oil in Morocco so the only reason I really use this is because of the argan oil and stuff and like you know when you've had your hair up in like a ponytail and then you want to wear it down but it has like the weird kink in it well <laughs> I've been spraying this it's a very expensive way to uh get my hair to not have the kink in it anymore um I could just use water but hey I've just found this um I don't think it's actually mine I think my friend left it at my house last time she came to visit. So Kerry, if you're watching, I owe you some of this because I've been using it. <laughs> I wouldn't pay for this. What? This is probably like 20 bucks or some shit. I don't even know how much it is, but it's something I probably wouldn't buy because of the price. But now that I know, like, it actually, it's pretty cool and I really like it. So I'll probably buy it again. I actually don't even straighten my hair. <laughs> God, I'm a fuckwit. I like it. I use it every day and it's... <sighs> smells fucking amazing. If anything, it's worth how good it smells. Like... What flavour is it? Does it even have a flavour? Just argan oil and Morocco. Like, it just smells nice and fruity and sort of... I don't know. If you've ever smelt fructus things, they all smell sort of the same. So, yeah. And it's green and orange, which is like... The theme of my fucking life. My wedding was green and orange. My favourite colour is green. Brendan's is orange. My YouTube channel theme is pretty much green and orange. Look, green pillow, orange hair. It's just meant to be. Speaking of uh, smelly things, my next favourite is um, this bad boy. It is, I think it's fantasy. Oh, here we go. Fantasy by Britney Spears. I got this for Christmas from my sister-in-law. Uh, she's amazing. She I, Every time that she wears it, oh, or her mum wears it and comes over, I'm always like, oh my god, you girls smell so good. And so then she got it for me for Christmas and I was so happy. I think the last time I had a proper perfume was actually... <laughs> Funnily enough, it was Christine Aguilera's, um, I don't even remember what it's called. Uh, I'll put a picture up of it. Yeah, it was like the best thing ever. And now I'm wearing Britney Spears. So 90s fucking pop divas represent Cheyenne. Mmm. Mmm. I love it. And it masks 
stank really well. <laughs> And that's what you want in a perfume. You want it to mask stank. If you have been a subscriber to my channel for a while and you remember, I think it was the contouring video that I did, like how to contour or something. I, I mentioned something about um, I don't have a beauty blender because I'm not a fuckwit. I'm pretty sure that was the actual words that I said. I don't have a beauty blender because I'm not like a fuckwit. <clears throat> I caved and I got one. <laughs> I just got it from Kmart, um, and it's already breaking, so that's fucking Kmart for you. But, you know, I, the, for the little amount of makeup that I do use, this is pretty good for that. I actually don't know how to use it properly. Um, I should probably look that up or something, but either way, I love it. There's not really much else I can say about it. <laughs> fucking, woo, woo woo beauty guru, yeah! <laughs> Uh, my next thing is also sort of beauty related, um, this La Cura Essentials Cleansing Wipes. This is them, I use them every day and it's really sad because it actually has on the back, I don't know if you can see that, but it says on the back like a recommended age group and it's <laughs> for 30 to 50 year olds and I am like well and truly now in that age group. And it's, uh, it's depressing thinking that I'm already, I'm buying anti-aging things already. Nevertheless, I really like them. Um, uh, they're just from Aldi, actually, and I think they were like a dollar fifty or something. Um, and you get like 30 in a packet and it's anti-aging with Q10, whatever the fuck that means. I don't even know. Um, usually these things like they dry out all the time, but these ones they like got some sort of cream on them or something, and they're really tough. Like here's the, here's the here. Let's go all full beauty guru on you here. Look, I don't even know if this is beauty guru. It's just like showing you what it's like. It's like tough and stretchy, and it's just mm -hmm. it gets everything off pretty well. So that's what you want in a fucking face white thing. I'm going to be saving that one for later. Um, the other thing that I'm loving and I still love at the moment is my phone case. It's literally just this green turquoise colour. I'm like really obsessed with this colour at the moment but like, I don't know, it feels like my phone's nice and safe in there. It kind of makes it look less fucked. If you can see the screen there is absolutely rooted. So I got it from eBay for like five ten dollars or something like that it's quite cheap but it was definitely worth it and i love it and when i get a new phone i'm gonna try and get the same one but like for the model that i'm gonna get because it's i love it i don't know it's cool and this color is like i love it at the moment and so does every other motherfucker like seriously why is it that when i like something everyone else starts liking it i mean it's definitely not the other way around is it <laughs> Okay, so um, the next thing that I'm loving at the moment is foreplay. <laughs> no, it's actually, I've just got the foreplay in there from um, a video that I just did on their channel. So, uh, you can't even. Anyway, I got this from Kmart. I think it was like 20 bucks or something. It was a Christmas present to myself <laughs> um, and I got it before I got this new camera so now when it's like in the background you can hardly see what it says because I like blur out the background but regardless I still love it and um, it's fun to play with it's fun for play <laughs> I'm a fuck with so my other favorite uh, is this sort of choker type thing I see that like everyone's wearing them as well and it's very 90s but they're really comfortable and you can just like, you don't even need to take it off to like do anything and it just kind of makes a look like complete and it makes me feel more, I don't know, it's weird, like secure, if that makes sense when I wear it. If I don't wear it I feel like exposed or something, I don't know, maybe I'm like really fucked in the head like. But yeah, I like it. Um, I like how it kind of completes a look, even though like my look is haggard mum. Anyway, I got this other one from Kmart. It it came in like this one came in a two pack, and I don't think I've never worn this one. I don't think I'm ever going to either. It's a bit weird, like 
why would you wear that? I don't know. But, you know, I got it for two bucks, so. And the last thing that I really, really like, I'm just looking over here. There's nothing left for me to show you except, of course, my neutral bullet. I'm not going to bring it up here because I'm upstairs and, like, fuck it. Here's a picture of it. Neutral bullet is fucking amazing. Everything, especially with, like, I don't want to talk too much about my weight loss in this video but um it's really good for that and it's really good for making baby food like I got it for my birthday two years ago like not my last birthday but for my 30th birthday and um it has I've been using it like all the time ever since like I use it for smoothies I use it for milkshakes I used it for like really bad foods as well like I used to make really good oh, chocolate like uh, peppermint frappes and stuff and different flavored frappes but um even now with my weight loss it's really good to make like juice cleanse things that I'm allowed to have or like even just baby food for Dexter it's good for making sauces and soups and everything and I love it like I seriously love it it's not one of those stupid as seen on TV products that you buy because everyone like because it's cheap or whatever like I got it and I have honestly used it like all the time it's seriously my favorite thing so <laughs> that's probably like my most favorite thing at the moment is sh is that my neutral bullet because fuck yeah it's fucking good ah. and yeah I can't fault it it's so except the only thing I can fault it on is how and loud it is like holy Jesus Christ it scares the shit out of Dexter every time I use it but apart from that it's absolutely perfect and I fucking love it so for the next 20 seconds or so I'm gonna just sit here and tell you guys to click this link here if you want to see more videos um, from me and if you want to see regular more videos what English uh, click the subscribe button which is right here and if you want to represent Cheyenne Jane, there's a Spreadshirt link right there for you to get my merch. Um, give me a thumbs up and see ya!